Stacy. I know right now might be a hard time for you, so I just wanted to give you some words of encouragement. Um, first of all, I love that God gave you the gift to be our leader because I know so many people just wouldn't want to take on that responsibility. They wouldn't want to lead or they just don't have that ability to. And I love that you have that and I just think it's really special. Um, and also that you tell us about your life that you're vulnerable and you're able to tell us even like the crappy things in life you tell us and you're not like ashamed of it or anything and I think that's like setting such a great example because like so many people <laughs> don't want to talk about the bad things in life and I like that you do and I know it's hard but like I love that you do um and that all of the other leaders I've had as I'm sure you know like they left, they were great leaders, but they left, but you're really the only one that has stuck with us for so long. And I know that you're always going to like, um, be able, I can always talk to you. So I love you and have a great week. Hey Stacy, I know that today is probably a really hard day for you and I wanted to let you know that I love you and I'm here for you and I'm praying for you and so are all of us other girls. And I just really love how strong you have been through this and you've really impacted my life a lot and I don't know where I'd be without you. So I really hope that today goes well and that you know that we're all here for you, we love you, and God is with you and you don't need a man. <laughs> Hey Stacy, I just wanted to tell you that I am so thankful that I've been able to call you my youth group leader and that I've been calling you that since sixth grade. Like we've had a lot of youth group leaders come and go, but you're the only one that has stayed with us through everything. Even when you were going through your divorce and you were going through hard times, you still were there for us and you still cared for us. And you are just so strong and you are so like, I look up to you so much. And I'm just so thankful that if through your hard time that you know you still were true to yourself and you were still true to god and that is just so like inspiring to me and uh when i look back on my middle school and high school years i am always going to remember how much you impacted me and my you know relationship with jesus and my confidence in myself and my relationship with him and I'm just so thankful that, you know, God ha chose you to be our youth group leader. And I hope that on today, even though it might be hard, I hope that you can rejoice in how far that, you know, like everything that's happened to you and just how you are much better than you were a year ago. And I just think that's something that should be celebrated. And God is definitely smiling down on you. He's so proud of you, Stacey. And all of us girls are too. And I love you so, so much. Hey, Stacy. I just want you to know that I've been thinking and praying about you, and I hope you have a great day. I miss you. Bye. Hi, Stacy. I just wanted to thank you for everything that you've done for our awesome group. And one thing that I love about you and all of our leaders, really, is that you're so willing to share what you've gone through in your life and everything that you've experienced in high school and in everything. And I think that really helps everyone to just know that, you know, you guys made it through and you guys are awesome. And it's just really nice to know that we can do this and benefit from hearing your guys' experiences. Hi, Stacy. I have only known you <clears throat> this school year, but I feel like I've known you for five years, and that's because of who you are. And I'm so thankful to get to serve with you. I've learned so much from being with you and in your presence. And I love that you are vulnerable and real I trust you, I would share anything with you. You're so much fun, you're hilarious. And I just appreciate all those qualities and I can't wait to continue serving with you. And next time I see you, I've been waiting to give you a few of your favorite things. Anyway, love you so much, appreciate you, and that's all. Hi Stacy, I miss you so much, but I just wanted to let you know that you are so inspiring and you mean a lot to me. You're a great leader and I'm so glad you've been with us for so long. <laughs>